Hello everyone. In this video, I will explain about probability activity with the help of dice. Aim of this activity is to get familiar with the idea of probability by throwing a pair of dice. Prerequisite knowledge required for the activity is the formula of probability of an event E, which is equal to number of outcomes favorable to the event divided by total number of outcomes. Material required is two dice. Let us see the procedure of the activity. Every time we will throw a pair of dice and we'll note down the outcomes in the table. See, as we throw a pair of dice, we get the outcomes as three comma three. Let us throw them again. See the outcomes. They are three comma five. We will keep on doing this for number of times. We get these type of outcomes, which are shown in the table. Let us try one more time. Here we get six comma five. It's interesting, right? Why not to try it again? Oh, we got five comma five. This observation we have already noted at the 17th place. So once again, we will not note down the same observation. These are the unique outcomes when we throw a pair of dice. These total number of outcomes are called as sample space. Here, we have arranged the outcomes in the proper manner. Observe the pattern of outcomes. If you arrange them in such a manner, it will be easier to answer the questions asked. Let us note down the observations. From the table, total number of possible outcomes equal to 36. Total number of favorable outcomes of product H are 2 which are 4 comma 2 and 2 comma 4. Total number of favorable outcomes of sum 10 are 3. Total number of favorable outcomes of sum greater than or equal to 11 are 3. Total number of favorable outcomes with prime numbers on each dice is equal to 9. Observe the pink boxes. On both the dice, the numbers are prime. The total number of favorable outcomes of doublets comes as 6. Means numbers on both the dice are equal. From the previous observation, we can conclude that probability of getting a product 8 is 2 by 36. Later, we can reduce the fraction. Then, probability of getting sum 10 is equal to 3 by 36. Probability of getting sum greater than or equal to 11 is 3 by 36. Probability of getting prime numbers on each die is 9 by 36. And probability of getting doublet is by 36. In this way, we perform this activity for a pair of dice. Now, try this. Find the sample space for the following. Thank you and be happy.